Yandere Simulator is supported by the following sponsors. Every night, for as long as I can remember, in this dream, I've always believed that this dream was showing me my future. I spent years fantasizing, and then, one year ago, I found him. The boy from my dreams is in the same school as me, but I'm too afraid to speak to him. So, for the past year, I've been in- He's my soulmate, but while we're at school, I was having so much fun watching him, learning everything about him, and planning our life together. But then, someone had to come. She's trying to take him from me, and I won't let her get away with it. After I disposed of the girl who was trying to steal my senpai, I left no trace of what I had done, or so I thought. When the police investigated the girl's disappearance, this was enough to make the police begin investigating the girl's disappearance as a possible murder case. A potential murder at an elite school was the headmaster didn't take it very well. I heard that he struck a deal with the police, the faculty, and the student council, but I can't rest yet. Another threat has appeared. She plans to confess her feelings to my senpai if I kill every girl who shows an interest in my senpai. So, even though I'm tempted to plunge a knife into her heart, I should eavesdrop on their conversation with a little bit of sabotage. I might... <laughs> it's you trying to intimidate me. <laughs> don't waste your time. You don't scare me. Ah, 
I am so cold! I know that this weather is perfect for everyone else, but for me, it's just too chilly. I've been like this ever since I was a little kid. I always need to be wearing a jacket or something, or else I'm just freezing. I wish I had learned how to sew, so I could go to the sewing room and knit myself a scarf or something. Jeez, how can anyone tolerate these freezing temperatures? I, I wish- What? You're going to get me a scarf? If you're being serious, I would really appreciate that. Can I, uh, help you with anything? <laughs> you don't really talk much, do you? My, my, you're quite comfortable here, aren't you? <laughs> Care to introduce yourself? Most students don't re- Don't you have a class to run along to? <laughs> you really seem to have a lot of free time on your hands. Well, I suppose you're technically not breaking any rules. <laughs> well, I suppose there's no harm in letting you spend a bit of time here. Gosh, you really did it! You brought me a scarf! Wait, did you make this yourself? Just now? You're amazing! Thank you! I really owe you one! Hehehe <laughs> 
Something wrong? After eliminating that girl. But now, I have a new problem to deal with. Another girl is sh a cute tomboy with boys like that sort of girl. If he keeps spending time around her, she might steal his heart. I can't let that happen. Now that I'm thinking about it, 
Apparently, she has a secret hobby. Something dangerous. It might be worth it to follow her around school. Perhaps I can find a way to make her bad habits backfire on her. You know what they say. You play with fire, and you get burned. <laughs> Are you okay? Intimidate me. Ha <laughs> 
Have a reason to be 